everyone, Stephanie here. Today we are going to be unboxing, setting this up, and trying out this automatic pet feeder. Alright, so out of the box, this is the little bag that it comes in, so everything must be included in here. Let's take it out of the bag and take a look at it. Right off the bat, I can tell you I like the size of it. It's got really nice clean lines. It looks good. It's not heavy at all. Let's open this up in here. Oh, so in here we've got... Um, we've got our instruction book, and then we have our power cord, our power adapter, our bowl. This is the size of the bowl, stainless steel. And then we have the little bowl that the stainless bowl sits in. So on the bottom here, um, if you don't have a place to plug this in with the cord and the adapter, you can install three of your batteries here, and then you've got the on-off switch over here. I'm going to be connecting it to power, so just plug up your cord to your adapter. And then this side, this is USB-C. It goes right down here on the bottom. So you've got your camera here. Um, you've got little, uh, this is where the, you can hear the audio from. This is a microphone. This is the lock button. And this is the manual feed button. So this is what it looks like down here. I've got some cat food in here. It does come with the little um, silica gel to absorb moisture. And that snaps in and then you just put your lid down and then this locks in place so it can't be opened until you turn that again. My cat is super interested in this, uh, this feeder so let's get into the app and see how to get this set up. So after we created our account we're going to add device. We're going to select P1 feeder. I can confirm that the power is turned on and the indicator light is flashing. So after you do that, you'll get a little QR code in the app and you point the QR code at the lens on the pet feeder. The pairing is successful. You can start using the camera now. All good, that was super easy to set up. So this is in my kitchen. And now we're looking at a live feed. This is me sitting in and front. Now we're and here is my cat, already super curious and here already eating cat, some of the food. If I want, I can record. Record. And it saves it, or I can and take a picture. It, or I can take a picture. You can go into the feeding record and get a documentation of all of the feeding times and whether it was manual or through the automatic. You can press automatic feeding and adjust when the feeding time starts and how much to feed. Um, one, if feeding amount one is just a few little kibbles, um, so what I think we're gonna do is about a four or a five for each feeding. And then you can select if you how often you want it to repeat. So let's say I want this to repeat every day. And you can say what time you want it to start at. And work your pet. You can also press the microphone and through the speaker on the feeder, it will say whatever you say in the microphone to your pet. So this is really great if you've been away for a little while. So a really, really cool automatic pet feeder for your house, for your cat, for your dog. Really, really like this. I love all the features of the app um, so that you can have some automatic commands there. But really, really cool. Uh, the cat likes it. Um, and this is going to help us with managing feeding our cat even when we are away. So thank you so much for watching and I hope you found this helpful.